Welcome to another Simple Engineering Snippet. In this instructional video, we calculate the total specific energy of an airstream. I hope you find it informative. Here is the problem statement. Our goal is to find the total energy of the airstream in BTUs per pound's mass. The specified units indicates that we are actually finding the total specific energy. Our goal is to find the total specific energy, E, in BTUs per pound's mass. Total specific energy is comprised of three energies, internal energy, kinetic energy, and potential energy. The internal energy is provided, so all that is left is to find the kinetic and potential energies. Let's start with specific kinetic energy, which is equal to one-half the velocity squared. This gives us units of feet squared per second squared, consistent with the internal energy units. Now let's calculate the specific potential energy, which is equal to the acceleration of gravity times the elevation of the airstream. Next, we add the three energies to get the total specific energy. We can see right away that the magnitude of the internal specific energy is significantly greater than both the specific kinetic and potential energies. It is quite common to consider the specific kinetic and potential energies as negligible, but we will include them for completeness. The last step is to convert feet squared per second squared into the desired units of BTU per pound's mass. I hope you found this instructional snippet useful. If so, then please like and subscribe. Thanks, and have a great day.